parents rather send their kids back to school in Forsyth County, they're noticing something a little bit different. All elementary schools have a secured lobby and guests are contained until their information is scanned through an online sex offender system. 11 Lives Brittany Klein Peter has the story. To have this vestibule where visitors are contained in an area until we know for certain that they are allowed to walk in the building it keeps the idea of children that it's safe to come to school. Forsyth County has been looking at security measures in schools and trying to consider how do we improve? What do we do to make it even safer? When parents come into the school, they are in the vestibule, so there's the locked doors in front of them and behind them and they cannot enter the school until their ID is scanned. Originally, our parents would walk straight into an office lobby. Once their ID is scanned through Raptor, they get a badge, and once they have that badge on, they are allowed into the school by the secretary. And Raptor is running a check for sex offenders, and if a um, individual is a sex offender, it does alert the school. Do we have a lockdown button too? To where if there was a situation where we had to go in a lockdown or someone in our building, they push that lockdown button. So if we were to go in a lockdown, a teacher would, and it gives them directions on what to do on a fire drill. I really like how the children can see that we're here to protect them. I like them to know that not anyone can just walk into the school. There's so much bad happening in our world that I think that anything that's gonna add to that to make our kids safe, then we should definitely you know, embrace it. Well, he was one.